three of the offensive linemen for the Apollo from Central Florida. There you see the hold right there. Thank you, brother. What's going on, guys? <laughs> they, they've scored like, or should have scored like three times. Ridiculous pass interference call. Now they're back. More rounds of dazzle. There you go. This, this is this is ridiculous. 37, 37 to six. Been playing Matt Sims all game. Yet another team to become the butt of all jokes. <laughs> it's looking that way, Alex. What's going on, Carson? Get bored with Fortnite? Yeah. Georgia will be the deepest team in college football next year. Uh, maybe. Start playing Apex. Let's see. Let's see what they do here. Our play clock almost got him. Damn, almost hit the camera. Whoa. Easy, guys. Man, this is this is pitiful. This is pitiful. Let's see. What's the problem here? He's trying to strip it. I mean, you can't blame the guy for being aggressive. Legends coach should be fired and never should have been hired, apparently. Maybe that's why nobody else hired him as a head coach. He sucks. Elliot Fry, 24 yard. There's a flag. Is there too many men on the field? The substitution. Oh my goodness. Now we got 12 players on the field. What? This this is definitely this is definitely a Georgia team. <laughs> oh man. I don't watch college CFL after this year's Sugar Bowl. I don't want to watch the NFL, but I love football. So yeah, I'm with you on that. Oh my goodness. I hope he sanks it. Just just uh, you got it. Well. No big surprise. They put up 40 points in the first game so far. Looks like we might actually get to see Aaron Murray throw the football. What's that? Yeah, yeah my wife's like, this is, this is about as bad as watching the Falcons play. Fire coil. He ne he never should have been a head coach. What is he doing? Why would you allow this to be somebody's first time head coach job? Hey, what's up, Uncle Lou? This 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 is terrible. Coyle, Coyle never should have been the coach for this team. They're finally putting Aaron Murray in with two minutes fifty three seconds. I hope he shows out on him. Hey, he made a ha! Look at that! Look at that! That's what happens when you put in a real quarterback. He completes a pass. Is ridiculous. Look at look at all the stats, man. Fifth round draft pick, second overall pick here. Georgia's. Oh my goodness. Here we go. Oh my goodness, twice. Look at that. See, nothing to it. You got the right quarterback in there. Maybe maybe with Aaron Murray, and we'll actually break double digits. What's going on, Jay? That was good for Orlando. Almost double yards. Look at this. Maybe, hey. Eh? No, this ain't incomplete. This is a good lick, though. This, this is sad, sorry, and pitiful. He's gonna tear that up, son. Unhired coil. Why, why was this guy ever hired to start with? He doesn't know what he's doing. He's getting out coached at every turn. 73 year old arthritic and crippled and crazy Steve Spurrier is out coaching this guy. At this point, and I hate to say this, but at this point, Mark Rick would have been a better hire. Uh, <laughs> Uncle Lou, they want to know if you'll give him a good morning. <laughs> Colton James. 
Hey, can you help him out with that song? Because he's, he's ready to body slam that thing. Georgia versus Legends, Legends win. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> I mean, two-minute warning. We got two timeouts left. Forty to six. It's just been an embarrassment so far. Look at that. That's, whoa, we got turned around right there. There we go. Carson, I try to read as many comments as I can when I get people on here. Sometimes I get a heavy stream, sometimes not so much, but I, I do try to read them. Look at this. Oh my goodness. Aaron Murray's throwing like a champ, dude. Aaron Murray is showing exactly right now why he should be in the game. It's raining, the ball's slick, ball's wet. I mean, I get, I get that Orlando is probably playing prevent defense, but they don't need to. Look at this. This looks like a completely different football team with Aaron Murray behind uh, Aaron Murray under center. It, just, it looks like a different team. Let's go. It's crazy. Look, he's, he's picking them apart, man. Aaron Murray looks comfortable. He looks fluid. He's running the team. He's moving guys around. He's not getting behind on the play clock. Moving with a sense of purpose. Good vision outfield. Threw an interception up. Shouldn't have bragged on him, I guess. God almighty. Oh, they're saying incomplete. Let's see. Here you go. Oh. I think he might have hit the ground there. I don't know. That's too close to tell from that angle. Look at old cripple. Like a red fox out there crippling around. Okay, challenge, man. Just side two minutes. I guess they are. I'm still learning stuff. Yeah, Aaron Murray better start next week. <clears throat> I want to see the other angle. That's, this is the angle that'll tell it. I thought it hit the ground like, no. That's, that's interception. Okay. Oh no, the ball hits the ground right there. Does it hit the ground? Looks like it hit the ground right there. Let's see. Ball hits the ground where? Right there. I think that's. I mean, it doesn't matter at this point. There's no way you're going to win the game, but whatever. Up. It's the ground. We're going to let it stand. We're going to let it stand. Good call. I love that they do the instant replay with mic'd up so you can hear what they're what they're looking at, how they go through it, instead of it just being... Nice. She could have confirmed it. Yeah, that's really cool to listen to. Yeah, I would agree. That's, that's pretty awesome to see that happen. Hey, guys, do me a favor. Give me a thumbs up, like. Uh, most of you guys are probably subscribed, so if you would go ahead and subscribe. Share all that good stuff. Hey, he did throw that one. <laughs> it didn't matter. He still threw a damn interception. <laughs> they went right back to the same play. Right back to the same play. Oh, my goodness. Why? Why? Look. 
golly, man. This is terrible. I mean, I'm enjoying watching football, and I'm seeing some different stuff, man, but this is... Uh, let's see if they'll just kneel it out. Let's see if they'll just kneel it out. Kneel it out. All right, kneel it out. Man, what a terrible end to a, a, a raggedy game. That was just terrible. There was... <laughs> He got, he got out coached at every turn. Every turn. Go ahead, son, because I know what you've been asked. <laughs> Just go ahead. <laughs> Matt Sims unemployed next week along with the coach. I agree with that, Jay. That that was ridiculous. <sighs> that was, oh my goodness. Why is Steve so hated? <laughs> well, he coached for South Carolina. So there's a lot of fans that don't like him because he had a tendency to want to run the score up in times when he didn't have to. Um, and me personally, my biggest problem with is that he walked out on his team in the middle of the season. And he left those players there that he had recruited to play the rest of the season without him as a head coach. Um, and he's, he's caused Georgia some headache in the, in, in the past year. So, yeah, I just I'm not a big fan of him. But as far as the game goes, I enjoyed watching the game tonight. I thought there was a lot of good interaction that happened um, that you get to see kind of behind the scenes. You hear the, the mic'd up stuff is nice. You hear and you see more, especially with the instant replay booth. You know, you can hear everything that's going on. I really like that. Um, I do, I got to admit, I do kind of miss the kickoff aspect, but I understand why they took it out. I do like the two point conversion. Uh, I think it makes it more interesting. Um, but as far as the, the actual, how, how the Atlanta Legends played, it was not legendary performance tonight. It was terrible. Uh, Georgia, uh, Atlanta's got a lot of work to do ahead of them. Um, but, you know, it, we've got a head coach that shouldn't be a head coach, especially in, in something that's supposed to be a pro league. Um, I wouldn't put that guy in charge of a high school team. He's never been a head coach. I don't see any reason why I would hire a guy who's never been a head coach to be a head coach of a professional football team. Um, I, I don't know why you wouldn't want to take and put in somebody at least that's a former college head coach from some Power 5 school. I'm sure there's a, a head coach of even an NFL football team that's retired that we could bring in. Um, Steve Spurrier, as much as I dislike the guy, he has a ton of track record and history as a head coach. So, and he showed it tonight. He continued to put points on the board, took advantage of Atlanta Legends at every turn. Uh, Matt Sims looked like a, a, a lost child in the middle of a, a freaking firefight. He didn't know what to do. Um, the offensive line couldn't seem to get anything going. Hey, what's up, Extra? I ain't seen you in a minute, brother. Um, I just didn't didn't really seem to know what in the world was going on. And I mean, there's nothing there's nothing you can do when you're getting out coached. I mean, trust me, as a Georgia fan, there, there's been several there's been several times that we've been out coached, and you know, especially during the years of Mark Rick. So, you didn't win, huh? <laughs> that happens, Carson. Trust me. Uh, um, any word on how Murray did? Murray did real well. Um, he come out and I think he went four for four and he threw an interception. But the interception he threw was an incomplete pass. And then they turn around and I'm betting Coyle called the same exact play again. And the same exact guy picked it off, if I'm not mistaken. So, I mean, it, it was terrible. It was terrible. Just bad coaching. Great players on the field. A lot of intensity out there. I mean, I saw some licks getting passed around. Guys popping right up. Both teams, I think, had a couple injuries. But, I mean, that's football. So, um, good to see that it, it had a pretty good fan attendance. It had some good announcers uh, other than Gary Daniels. Um, I thought it was a pretty good game as far as the way that they play it. Um, it was really difficult, really difficult to tell the difference between it and the NFL. If you're watching it, I mean, it looked legitimate. It didn't look like Arena League football. It didn't look like Australian rules rugby. It didn't look like, it didn't look like the XFL. It looked like legit football. And I think that's going to garner a lot of fans. I think there's going to be a lot of people that are going to jump on this bandwagon 
and and really take it for a ride because it's fun to watch. I mean, it had all the markers of a, a football that we like. It's got four quarters. The, I also noticed it was way faster. Um, the game the game was over way quicker. There's no TV timeouts. Um, one of San Diego versus Antonio QB play was awful, man. Yep. Uh, we placed 15. We didn't win that game. What, you, what are you talking about, Carson? You talking about Fortnite? I will destroy you. Anyway. Um, uh, but as far as the play goes, they kept it moving, uh, which was great. Uh, there was no TV timeouts when they had commercials. They slapped them to the side. It was a lot of fun to watch. and kept it upbeat. I didn't feel lost. Um, I, I enjoyed it. I, th I thought it was. I thought it was very entertaining to watch. Did I hear about the Miami grad transfer? Our receiving core is going to be stacked. You're talking about for. You're talking about for the dogs. Yeah, I heard about that guy. Um, did you also hear that Marshall Long took a medical red shirt so that we we can fit the scholarship system uh, properly? So that's good too. Anyway, guys, I don't want to make it too long of a video tonight. Appreciate you guys jumping on. Um, we're going to make some more videos. I'm going to be working with some other. Um, yeah, he did take one for the team. You're right. I'm going to be working with some other YouTube content creators um, and, and, you know, going forward on this Alliance football thing. Oh, my son's playing Fortnite. Right now he's playing Fallout 76. So what's up, Caden? Hi. Hi. Yeah. So anyway. Um, <clears throat> I'm going to be doing some other work with some other content creators, so hopefully we'll have some more content for the uh, AAF on here. What's your, uh, um, hey, extra, if, once I upload this video, jump down in my comment section and throw a chat in with your, your, your PSN stuff so I can have them reach out to you. Me? Yeah, you. We're talking about Fortnite. Yep. All right, I got you extra. All right, guys, thanks so much for jumping on. We'll catch you guys next time. Uh, I'll be doing some videos in the come up week on the AAF, and uh, we'll see you guys soon. Have a great day. God bless.